Hey guys, welcome back to Ritu here. Today we're doing something really cool. We're going to be looking at the PlayStation 2023 wrap-up. I'm going to sign in here and we're going to do it together because there's also some cool new collectibles this year, which they've never done before, on PlayStation Stars. And you actually get a unique one but out of like a batch of uh, like a half a dozen or more depending on what your most played genre was for the year. So these collectibles, you can't get all of them. You can just get the one, and it's specific to you. So, for example, there's like a Thrill Seeker one. There's one called The Goat. There's one called Connoisseur. Um, there's a Role Player one for people who just dumped a billion hours into Baldur's Gate. Uh, there's one called Speedster that I got, I think maybe because of Rocket League, or maybe it's because this was the year I took up Gran Turismo for the first time after the movie. I don't know, but we're going to find out by doing our wrap-up, and then that's going to also connect to our PlayStation Stars collectible, and I thought you guys might be interested in this. You don't actually just get the collectible also, you do have to still play a game from a certain batch of games or I thought I'd let you know that as well so for example my speedster one wanted me to play either MX versus ATV Legends, Wreckfest, Assetto Corsa Competizione, <laughs> Destruction All-Stars, Overpass, or Trackmania Turbo but a lot of those are included in like PlayStation Plus and stuff like that so I was able to do that but whatever one you do get you're gonna have to actually still play something to get the collectible and it's on a timer so check that out uh, in your stars or by doing your wrap up and then your stars but let me sign in here and we'll i'll show you guys what the wrap up is because i think it's really really cool honestly they do these every year uh, for the last little while and they're a lot of fun it's just cool to see how much you play so here we are this is my 2023 wrap up that i share with you guys you can do these yourselves compare with me in the comments and stuff let me know they have really made this look nice this year uh, I've played 134 games this year. <laughs> That's a lot. Um, a lot of those are for YouTube, of course. And uh, my first game of the year that I played was Rocket League, apparently. What's this at the bottom? Oh, this is cool. Share greatest achievement. Select a card to share. Okay, so there's our... On January 1st, I played Rocket League. Look at that. I don't miss a day. I don't miss a day in Rocket League. I quit Rocket League this year, to be fair. I don't play anymore. Um, my biggest hitters. Oh, see, this is why I got Speedster. This is my biggest hitters of 2023. This is uh, Gran Turismo 7. I played the most, so that's why I got Speedster. There you go. I just took up Gran Turismo after the movie. Um, I thought the movie was great, and I just was like, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna play Turismo, and I loved it. And there it is, 44 hours just past Rocket League. With 43, I've played Rocket League in a really long time. Payday 3, then Hogwarts, and then Fortnite. Um, for a fact, if this was gonna take right up to January 1st. Fortnite is now past all of these. I've put so many hours in Fortnite this last week. This was like just barely because it's now way above, way above Turismo. <laughs> but I don't want to talk about that. Uh, let's see what's next. Uh, that Fortnite number is just in the last like week of the whole time they were counting because I didn't play that game all year until until the new stuff came out. Um, my gaming style, speedster, 20% of my game time with my foot down. Oh, I'm a speedster. So this one here will be whatever your collectible is. It can be different things, and uh, you'll get a card that looks just like this one here, this speedster one. That's what the collectible looks like. Um, that's really cool. I like this. For they set up a really nice little like website for this. This is some crazy stuff. What I got up to month by month. Ah, uh, this is the month where I was playing on PC a lot, so my girlfriend was stuck upstairs playing Stardew Valley. <laughs> That's uh, not me. Uh, February, we did all of Hogwarts. That was all done in February. Oh, we played some Rainbow Six Extraction in March. It was free on Extra in March. Then Meet Your Maker came out on PS Plus day one in April. We played that in April. Cult of the Lamb, I picked that up in May amazing game this is so cool cozy grove again this is my girlfriend she's cozy groved up in june um then <laughs> in july the only game i played was this free piece of garbage for three hours to get a platinum trophy and then uh then i tried out sea of stars in august uh then payday came out i put a bunch of hours into payday in september uh, then I picked up Turismo when I saw the movie, and I just started going crazy on Turismo. More Turismo in November, and now I'm a Fortnite gamer. What can I say? I'm a Fortnite gamer. Yeah, here in December, that'll carry on into January for sure. Um, here we go. Playlist for speedsters. 
Oh, here we go. It tells you, uh, here's some games you'd like. Oh, these are the ones that you have to play for the collectibles. So now, if you got your collectible from the earlier one, this page will tell you one of these you'll have to play uh, for your collectible. They're all like an extra or premium. Hopefully there's a way that Normal Plus people can get these. I know Wreckfest was included in Normal PS Plus at some point. Um, so was Destruction All-Stars. So hopefully the ones that come up on your list you don't have to pay to get. I think Trackmania is free, but I could be wrong. I don't know. Hopefully in your list you have one of the games already or something like that. Because it's a pretty cool collectible to get. This year I played 520 hours. I spent 80% of game time playing 86 games on your PlayStation 5. Beautiful. What's the bottom thing for that? 520 hours. 86 games. Uh, it took up most of my time, apparently. And I earned a whopping 700 trophies. I got uh, 11 platinums. I got up to silver on the on the metal thing. That's cool. I got 11 platinums this year. That's pretty good. A little low for me, but pretty decent. 704 trophies for the year. My social style is party animal. I partied up with 82 parties this year. Oh, so many chat parties. And uh, what else did we do? I earned 125 digital collectibles and earned 4,260 points on PlayStation Stars. Here's all the collectibles I got. Look at that. I'm crazy. Two legendary ones. Um, oh, this too. At the end of the wrap-up, you get another collectible. I forgot about this. You get a legendary, which are extremely rare. A legendary Marvel Spider-Man spider bot. So there's the Prowler bot and the spider bot. That's really cool. Uh, you get that at the end for doing your wrap-up right into your stars account and here's where you can uh, share and compare you can uh, download it um, let, oh there's the voucher you guys can't use my voucher nice try I already used it at the end you'll get a little code here that you can use that on the PlayStation Store redeem it and uh, you'll get your PlayStation Stars collectible of the little spiders they look like uh, look like they look sorry they look like that over there it's in the middle of the screen it's beautiful look at that um, pretty sweet little thing they put together here there's some ads for playstation stuff yeah this is uh really cool really sleek and clean this year this is way better than the one last year and i liked that one too but uh there it is i'm a speedster because i played too much turismo right now i'm a fortnite star i'll tell you that um that fortnite is actually the most played game of the year for me apparently just in the last <laughs> just in the last month they really went crazy um yeah there it is that's the playstation wrap up I also thought I'd throw in here at the end, instead of making a whole new video, a couple other campaigns that just came out at the same time. There's a new collectible that looks like this for launching Destiny 2. Uh, if you don't know, you should keep Destiny 2 just installed if you have the room for it, uh, because they tend to be doing a lot of these. But there's that one, free to play to do that, uh, you just have to launch it. And then there's a new multiplayer Mayhem one that gives you 50 points. For playing either Rocket League, Final Fantasy XIV, Ark Survival Evolved, or DayZ. Um, Rocket League is free to play as well, so you can use it uh, to get that. And then there's a new last one standing that looks like that. I don't remember the games, but it'll tell you in there. Um, but you can just use Fortnite if you want for free. Uh, so there's a free way to get all of those. And that is about it. There's also new in the rewards section. I might make a video about them, but uh, a couple of these... The Ezio Trilogy Hidden Blades uh, for points to buy those. They're 350 points each, which you get from doing challenges or for buying games. And uh, you can buy the Hidden Blade from each of the three Ezio games. And that is about it. Back to back to other me for the outro. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. Do your wrap up. Let me know what you think. You know, share some of those things with me. That's uh, really cool. What was your most played game? What was your uh, how many games? How many trophies? Stuff like that is really cool. Uh, don't compare to mine. <laughs> I'm a bit of a no life. Uh, you know, I do a lot of it for content, obviously, but also I'm, I'm always, I'm always gaming too much. I do a lot of gaming, but you know, what are we, if not <laughs> gamers? <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. Um, I appreciate it. I hope you had a great 2023 and you know, here's to a good 2024. We're going to be playing even more great games in 2024. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Uh, subscribe if you want to see more from me. New PlayStation Stars and just general gaming videos every other day. I really went in this year. I've done so many uploads. And I appreciate all you guys supporting me along the way. I hope you guys have a great night or day. And 
I love you.